New York, AP, Julius Randle scored 35 points, Evan Fournier made the go-ahead three-pointer in the second overtime and added 32 against his former team, and the New York Knicks outlasted Jalen Brown and the Boston Celtics 138-134 to on Wednesday night. Brown scored a career-high 46 points after overcoming a bout of COVID-19 and Jason Tatum had the biggest basket of his awful opener with a three-point play that gave Boston a 134-133 lead with 1.05 remaining. Fournier then hit his fourth three-pointer of the overtimes with 56 seconds to go and Derek Rose finished it off with a basket with 22 seconds to play as the Knicks finally put away a game they seemed to have won much earlier. The Celtics put together a push late in regulation of their first game under Coach Inio Doka and Marcus Smart tied it with a three-pointer at the buzzer. RJ Barrett scored all of his 19 points after halftime and Obi Toppin added a career best 14 for the Knicks. Kemba Walker had 10 points and 8 assists against his previous team. Tatum had 20 points and 11 rebounds, but was 7 for 30 from the field, including 2 for 15 from 3 point range. The US Olympic gold medalist missed badly on a jumper that could have won it at the end of the first overtime. The Knicks showed off more offensive punch than last season's team that finished 41-31 in its first season under Coach of the Year Tom Thibodeau, making the playoffs for the first time since 2013. That was largely behind the all-around play of Randall, the runaway winner of the Most Improved Player Award, and a defense that led the league in fewest points and lowest shooting percentage allowed. 